I would people ha- called you, what did people call you? Baby, when you- baby Gronk. Yeah. Ba- P- I think freshman year that, that nickname started coming out. Um, I, I don't know. I would, uh, Gronk is just, you can't, like, I can't not say Gronk. Like, I just, you know, right when I started playing tight end my freshman year of high school and realized, like, all right, maybe I can go to college for this, whatever, that was kind of Gronk in his prime, just balling with Brady. And that's, you know, kind of how I want to be when, when I get to the NFL. All right, we're going to do a rookie profile on Micah Mayer, tight end out of Notre Dame, 6'4", 265, projected to be a first-rounder, five-star recruit coming out of high school. When I watched the film, I saw a big target, hard to bring down. Looks like he's always open. Gets yak. 2019 Mr. Kentucky coming out of high school. In 2020, he had the most missed tackled force after receptions out of all D1 tight ends. And his previous season was a John Mackey finalist. The only reason he didn't win it is because of that monster Brock Bowers coming out next year. But we'll talk about him another time. The negatives, sorry, but it's no real negatives. He's more like a Ertz than a Kelsey, if that's a negative. His film isn't gonna blow you away and make you become an instant fan, but I'm more than confident he would be very productive throughout his career. Michael Meyer is an early declare. He gotten better each year he was in college. He had the highest PFF grade out of all college tight ends this past season. Depending on his athleticism at the combine, which should be fine, he will earn my future tight end one badge. Mayer feels like a safe pick. Once he secures first round draft capital and proves his athleticism at the combine, he will pretty much be a bulletproof prospect. I can't predict how long it's gonna take due to me not knowing his landing spot, but I'm confident he'll be a future tight end one down the line.